So there is an Eldis Magnum GT 196 67949. Let's have a look at this one. Swivel seat, it's got all the, let's go and have a look. DAB radio, solar panel, awning, alarm, got loads of spec on it. Let's get in and have a little look and see what this one's all about then. Right, so we've got a bin on the door. We have a small window in the doorway, which is always a good thing. Let's get in and see what the layout's like in here. So it looks like we've got a rear lounge style motor home in this one. So obviously that will make up into a bed. And then we've got this area here, like a lounge area that also would double up as a bed. So, and we have a drop down bed. So does this make up into a bed? I'm, so this may make up into a bed across that way, um, that way across there, but we've got a drop down bed in here. So it's more of a family orientated motor home on the Peugeot manual gearbox. And uh, you know what I'm like, we just get the position, look down through this motor home, let's check it out. And yeah, drop down bed, electric drop down bed. I can see the wires up there on the left hand side. And uh, let's have a little look down through this motor home. So we come up to the rear lounge and there's a big window at the back. Plenty of vision, some nice cushions, scattered cushions around here. There's a TV bracket up on the side there. Uh, there is a chest of drawers down through there with obviously the hanging space in the wardrobe in this one with a table and some more bits and pieces, sponges and stuff tucked away in there. Um, we're just going to come around there. They've got a Dometic fridge situated down on the bottom there. Let's just have a look and refresh ourselves how big that fridge is. Uh, so it's not the biggest fridge on the planet. Um, you know, if, if you're looking basically here, this is like a family style motor home. Let's have a look in this fridge. Not the biggest fridge on the planet for a family motor home. And uh, you've got plenty of uh, cooking facilities here. Uh, for your food preparation and stuff. Um, nice worktop, we've got a nice big sink here, like in the black, uh, which is a little bit unusual. We've got some USB sockets by the door, and uh, this looks like the um, operation for the bed. Here, there's a switch here with a key, and there's a microwave up the top here. There's some beautiful cupboards, nice cupboards up here, plenty of uh, plate rack and um, bottle storage up the top there. Just having a little look round. Right, let's have a look in the bathroom then. So a nice chrome door on there. Let's get in and have a look. Oh, so we're back to this kind of little tiny bowl style sink. Um, feels okay. Okay, we'll, we'll, uh, <laughs> we'll let them off with that one. Um, so yeah, we got, so it's a little bit strange with this, obviously the wheel arch is in the way of the shower tray, so it minimizes the shower tray a little bit with that arch being there. And the toilet again is maybe sat up a little bit high on there, look. Is that a little bit high? <laughs> so, so obviously someone with um, shorter legs, maybe you had to go that way. Okay, you might be able to get away in that way. Toilet roll holder on the side, little cabinet up on the, on the, the back on the side here, little cabinet up there. So um, there we go, there we go. Okay, so there it is. More, plenty of storage up around the top. We've got plenty of storage in these things. Loads of cupboards all the way down through. But uh, there we have it. So we just literally look around motorhomes, given our view, Magnum. That'll do on that one then.